Hello, today we'll discuss about a rule of nines for adult bonds. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe this channel. First of all, let's see what is rule of nines. Rule of nine is used to calculate the total body surface area which is burned. That means we can calculate and identify how much body surface area burned. The percentage of burns we can identify through this rule of nine. Now let's see why to calculate it. Why we need to know the percentage of burn? The first thing is to know the severity of burn. By calculating the percentage, we will identify the severity of burn. And the second thing is to reduce the risk of hypovolemic shock. Because in the first 24 hours, mainly the patient will end up into hypovolemia due to the burn. So to reduce the risk of hypovolemic shock, we need to calculate the percentage and we should know about the severity of burn. Now let's see the rule of nine. So here the picture shows the posterior and anterior part of our body. So we'll start from head to toe. So first we'll start from head and neck. We can give four and half percentage in the posterior part and four and half percentage in the anterior part. So total we will have nine percentage. So if the patient come with burn in head and neck area the posterior and anterior part is burned we can give nine percentage next is upper thorax or the chest area so posterior part we can give nine percentage and the anterior part we can give nine percentage so total will be 18 percentage next is abdomen same like chest we can give nine percentage anterior and nine percentage posterior the total will be 18 percentage now we can give one percentage for genital area now coming to hands anterior and posterior part of each hands so anterior part is four and half percentage posterior part is four and half percentage so one total hand is like nine percentage coming to legs anterior and posterior part of each leg anterior part of leg is 9% and posterior part of one leg is 9% so total one leg is 18% this is how we need to calculate the percentage of burns i hope you all understood this video if you have any doubts please comment below if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you